answer. Because you are that, you are capable. You are gifted and you are so unique. All of the things that you may hate about yourself are your strengths. It's okay to be soft. It's okay to be opinionated. It's okay to be different. And it's so okay to just be The world awaits to receive you. move on on all right let's move on to this this i found is very interesting and this is not the first time that it's been played but i need you guys to pay attention because this is what they do this is what they do to you this is what they do mine is so warrior let's listen let's listen lisa this is extremely dangerous to our democracy. 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 Uh, I just wanted to share you that. Lashley, well, I'm going to say, <laughs> I'm going to say, I said Lashley, y'all know my name. Grace Leva, I am severely, severely dangerous for your democracy. Moving on. Love me or hate me. Love me or hate me. I am here. I am here. All right. Let's move on. This one was funny, guys. Okay. We're going to watch this together. I hope we can watch it. It don't look, it look all weird on the screen. Hold on. What the hell is that? Let's see. I probably don't get to show y'all that. I just saw it. It was so funny. And now I can't show y'all. All right. I'm going to try to get back to show y'all that. But. I do want to get on to one more, one more topic. Okay, we do have some more serious topics. This is our, this topic a little bit serious. Okay, because at the end of the day, um, there's a war for freedom of speech. There's a war to make us say and do the things that they want us to do. And at the end of the day, I respect everybody else's opinion or what they feel they are or what they want to do. But you cannot push that on people. And to put somebody in jail. A high school teenager, this motherfucker is turning crazy. I don't give a damn. This is ridiculous. And I'm a motherfucker say it. That's why I homeschool. Excuse my language. No more cursing. High school students suspended, arrested for saying only two genders in the name of diversity at Catholic school. A Catholic school. And Renfrew suspended a student and had him arrested for saying there are only two genders. Josh Alexander was suspended last November over comments made about gender in class and told he couldn't return to class until he recanted. On Monday, Alexander returned to class and was promptly met by the vice principal, arrested by two local police and charged with trespassing. Wow. The now seemingly former student of St. Joseph Catholic School High School told the National Post in the interview that he made comments during the class discussion on gender. This is fucking ridiculous. This is fucking ridiculous. Ah, I, I, I mean, at the end of the day, I just I make a comment. Y'all make a comment. Is this right? Is this right? 
He can say what he want to say. People feelings are so up in their ass that we can't even talk. I miss the 90s. I miss the 90s. I want to go back to the 90s because the 90s, we were able to say and, and do what we wanted to do. We were able to, to be free a little bit. And people wasn't so damn sensitive and we were more tougher. Because this young man just said it's two genders. Not only does he get suspended, but he goes back and because he don't recant, he locked up. He arrested for trespassing. That's wrong. I don't care what color he is. That sh shit is wrong. And you need to take a look and really think where our society is going. Because this ain't copacetic. I don't care what sex you are, who you like to sleep with. This is not copacetic. You know why? Because I like to be uncensored. And I can say what I want to say. I mean, in the respects, he didn't say anything derogatory towards other people who choose not to participate with the two genders, even though they, you know, whatever, some of them are calling themselves women, some of them calling them men, calling them whatever. He didn't say anything derogatory towards them. So, like I said, this should be unwarranted. And I really think, I don't care if you transgender, you gay, if you're human. You should understand that this is wrong. I have watched some gay and transgenders and bisexual people know that there's a line that is being crossed and that people are losing their freedom. Even with the topic, because we're going to do a full broadcast about Trump ass, talking about he coming after the transgenders. And because a lot of people, a lot of young people, when they get older, they have issues with the decisions they made as a child. What is wrong? What, 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 what is our society coming to? That we can't objectively think and talk and have everything out on the table, get through the emotions and make critical decisions. I feel some type of way for this young white boy. That shit shouldn't happen. I was his mother. I'll pull him out of that school so fast and homeschool his ass too. You black people don't only need to be homeschooled. The people who don't want to take no shh need to homeschool their kids. The people who want their kids to have a free mind and think for themselves and understand how a economy and all the world around it and things like that, not just what the books teach them, need to homeschool. And I'm going to leave that shit like that because that's disrespectful. That is disrespectful. I'm sorry. Because you are that, you are capable, you are gifted, and you are so unique. All of the things that you may hate about yourself are your strengths. It's okay to be soft. It's okay to be opinionated. It's okay to be different. And it's so okay to just be.